Hey, people, how's it going? Here's hoping my game doesn't crash again. I did this already. I got through the cutscene, and, uh, yeah. I saved just before it crashed, but the file was corrupted when I when looked at it. So here we go. This is the top of the tower. And look, it's an ogre. Ogre. If you get that reference, you have an old gold star. Oh man! Oh, you got a you got a titty ouch. All right, we will try and um, try and do this. Please freeze. Please be Show frozen. Right. Freeze, bitch. Please die. Die, die, swoon. Move and parry, strike and kill. Best kill ever. Beacon is over here. We've surely yeah, I know. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta. Quickly before it's too late. I gotta steal shit. Jesus, Alistair, we've done, we've been through this before, literally. I got robbed. Last time there was a fucking health poultice. Okay, here we go. Light in the beacon. Please don't crash on me, game. Please, please, please don't. Not today. It was the first time Dragon Age has crashed on me. Sound the retreat. But <gasps> what about the king? Should we not do as I command? Yeah. Lady, don't you question me. I got better hair. Pull out! All of you, let's move. Telling the guys to pull out. So, we see his play for power now. I'm just hoping I can get through this. Oh, and if you're curious, I've got, uh, like 70 Canadian dollars, which is like 50 American dollars in my PayPal account. And I buy my motherboard and graphics card from New Egg, which is Canadian. So I've saved up about half that money. But I still, uh, Netflix comes out of my PayPal, so. Yeah. I think if uh, we ever get our taxes filed and my husband gets his money back, we might actually have enough money to, to get this fixed. When did he get stabbed? Or is this just ongoing wounds? So I never saw him get hurt. Kaylin's dead. That poor armor. I'm glad I don't have to clean it up. Hook up. Well, the bonfire's lit. What the fuck, man? Low gain. Cut and ran. Like a pussy. And there we are. My meat shields were not working. I may stop in the middle of this to uh, just get the recording as soon as I can, which probably won't be because there's a shitload of uh, 
Cutscenes. Ah, your eyes finally Don't open. look. Mother shall be pleased. I'm in my underwear. Don't look. Okay. I'm going to see if I can do this. Ready? Okay. Okay, so what happened to the dark spot? You were injured and then mother rescued you. Do you not remember? I remember being overwhelmed by Darkspawn. Mother managed to save you and your friend, though it was a close call. What is important is that you both live. The man who was to respond to your signal quit the field. The Darkspawn won your battle. Those he abandoned were massacred. Your friend, he is not taking it well. What happened to the Grey Wardens and the King? All dead. Your friend has veered between denial and grief since Mother told him. He is outside by the fire. Mother asked to see you when you awoke. Were my injuries severe? Yes, but I expect you shall be fine. The Darkspawn did nothing Mother could not heal. Um... Why does your mother want to see me? I do not know. She rarely tells me her plans. Okay, uh... Thanks for helping. I... You were welcome. Though mother did most of the work, I am no healer. Uh, questions? I do not mind. Take your time. How'd she manage to save us? She turned into a giant bird and plucked the two of you from atop the tower, one in each talon. If you do not believe that tale, then I suggest you ask Mother yourself. She may even tell you. Uh, are we safe here? We are safe for the moment. Mother's magic keeps the Darkspawn away. Once you leave, tis uncertain what will happen. The Horde has moved on, so you might avoid it. Okay. Anybody else besides us? Only stragglers that are long gone. You would not want to see what is happening in that valley now. Why? What's happening? Are you sure you want me to describe it? I wouldn't have asked. I had a good view of the battlefield. It is a grisly scene. There are bodies everywhere and darkspawn swarm them feeding, I think. They also look for survivors and drag them back down beneath the ground. I cannot say why. Uh, I think I asked this one. I wonder at that myself. But she tells me nothing. Perhaps you were the only ones she could reach. I would have rescued your king. A king would be worth a much higher ransom than you. Yep, much higher. What a sensible attitude. Mother is seldom sensible, however. Well, I think I've asked enough. I agree. Tis time you speak with Mother, then be on your way. Oh, yes, okay. I'm gonna save. There we go. All right. Right. Take this. This is locked. We can't pick it, so let's go out. Please don't crash, game. Plus, plus, plus. Hopefully, I remember all the dialogue I said. Is I did get a new cutscene. Here is your fellow Grey Warden. You worry too much, young man. You, you're alive. <laughs> I thought you were dead for sure. Afraid you're going to be left alone? Duncan's dead. The Grey Wardens. Even the King. They're all... dead. Oh, this doesn't seem real. If it weren't for Morrigan's mother, we'd be dead on top of that tower. Do not talk about me as if I am not present, lad. I, I didn't mean... But, but what do we call you? You've, ne you've never told us your name? Names are pretty, but useless. The chastened folk call me Flemeth. I suppose it will do. The Flemeth? From the legends? Daveth was right. You're the Witch of the Wilds, aren't you? And what does that mean? I know a bit of magic, and it has served you both well, has it not? Oh, why did you save us? Well, 
We cannot have all the Grey Wardens dying at once, can we? Someone has to deal with these dark spawn. It has always been the Grey Warden's duty to unite the lands against the Blight. Or did that change when I wasn't looking? Land's hardly united thanks to Loghain. That doesn't make any sense. Why would he do it? Power? Now that is a good question. Men's hearts hold shadows darker than any tainted creature. Perhaps he believes the Blight is an army he can outmaneuver. Perhaps he does not see that the evil behind it is the true threat. The Archdemon. <gasps> the Archdemon. Well, we should contact the rest of the Grey Wardens. Kaelin already summoned them. They'll come if they can, but... I expect Loghain has already taken steps to stop them. We must assume they won't arrive in time. Okay, so what is the Archdemon? It is said that long ago... The Maker sent the old gods of the ancient Tevinter Imperium to slumber in prisons deep beneath the surface. An archdemon is an old god awakened and tainted by Darkspawn. Believe that or not, history says it's a fearsome and immortal thing, and only fools ignore history. All right, then we need to find it. By ourselves? No Grey Warden has ever defeated a Blight without the army of a half dozen nations at his back. Oh, blah, blah, blah. Mention, the... I don't know The damn how. treaties. How to kill the Archdemon or how to raise an army. It seems to me those are two different questions, hmm? Have the Wardens no allies these days? I, 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 I don't know. Duncan said that the Grey Wardens of Orlais had been called, and Arl Eamon would never stand for this, surely. Wait there. Arl of Redcliffe? I suppose. Arl Eamon wasn't at Ostagar. He still has all his men. And he was Kaelin's uncle. I know him. He's a good man, respected in the Landsmeet. Of course, we could go to Redcliffe and appeal to him for help. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, Loghain was also an honorable man. would never do what Tan Loghain did. I know him too well. I still don't know if Arl Eamon's help would be enough. Can't defeat the Darkspawn horde by himself. Okay. Then we need other allies. Of course! The treaties! Grey Wardens can demand aid from dwarves, elves, mages, and other places. They're obligated to help us during a blight. I may be old, but dwarves, elves, mages, this Arl Eamon, and who knows what else. This sounds like an army to me. So can we do this? Go to Redcliffe and these other places and build an army? I doubt it'll be that easy. <laughs> and when is it ever? It's always been the Grey Warden's duty to stand against the Blight. And right now, we're the Grey Wardens. So you are set then, ready to be Grey Wardens. I'll be happy with just staying alive. Hmm. Come to think of it, that would be nice. <laughs> well, don't expect me to do everything. There is, however, one more thing I can offer you. The stew is bubbling, Mother dear. Shall we have two guests for the eve? Or none? The Grey Wardens are leaving shortly, girl. And you will be joining them. Such a shame. What? You heard me, girl. The last time I looked, you had ears. <laughs> Excellent. Have I no say in this? You have been itching to get out of the wilds for years. Here is your chance. As for you, Wardens, consider this repayment for your lives. Is this your idea all along? Pardon me, but I had the impression that you two needed assistance, whatever the form. Not to look a gift horse in the mouth, but won't this add to our problems? Out of the wilds, she's an apostate. If you do not wish help from us illegal mages, young man, perhaps I should have left you on that tower. Point taken. Mother, this is not how I wanted this. I'm not even ready. You must be ready. Alone, these two must unite for Eldon against the Darkspawn. They need you, Morrigan. Without you, they will surely fail, and all will perish under the Blight. Even I. 
I understand. And you wouldn't. Do you understand? I give you that which I value above all in this world. I do this because you must succeed. Yeah, I get it. Allow me to get my things, if you please. Please don't crash. No, 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 don't do it. Don't. I am at your disposal, Grey Wardens. I suggest a village north of the wilds as our first destination. It is not far, and you will find much you need there. Or, if you prefer, I shall simply be your silent guide. The choice is yours. Now speak your mind. <laughs> you will regret saying that. Don't crash. Dear sweet mother, you are so kind to cast me out like this. How fondly I shall remember this moment. Well, I always said, if you want something done, do it yourself. Or hear about it for a decade or two afterwards. I just... Do you really want to take her along because her mother says so? We need all the help we can get. I guess you're right. The Grey Wardens have always taken allies where they could find them. I am so pleased to have your approval. Alright, let's go. Farewell, Mother. Do not forget the stew on the fire. I would hate to return to a burned down hut. Bah! Tis far more likely you will return to see this entire area, along with my hut, swallowed up by the blight. I... All I meant was... Yes, I know. Do try to have fun, dear. Okay. Yep, oh, yep, we got everything. Let's go, go, go. Come on, give me this quest quickly so I can save. We can... Alright. There we go. Alright, we got to save. We got a break, so it should be good here. So, Alistair... I had to level up. There we go. And now we were... Hmm. Oh, yes, and he gets the Aegis. All right, there we go. As you here's the world map, Flemish Hut. So I guess we're going to Lothering. Please don't crash game. Oh, fight! Cutscene. And I expect each of you to supply these men. We must rebuild what was lost at Ostagar, and quickly. There are those who would take advantage of our weakened state if we let them. We must defeat this Darkspawn incursion, but we must do so sensibly and without hesitation. Your Lordship, if I might speak. You have declared yourself Queen Honora's regent and claim we must unite under your banner for our own good. This guy's mouthy. But what of the army lost at Ostagar? Your withdrawal was most fortuitous. Ooh! Everything I have done has been to secure Ferelden's independence. I have not shirked my duty to the throne, and neither will any of you. Because I the live in a snow will globe. not bow to you simply because you demand it. Understand this. I will brook no threat to this nation from you or anyone. Ooh, he thinks he's in charge and shit. Now that went Aunt over Eden, well. Please, your Majesty, your father risks civil war 
If Eamon were here... Antigon, my father is doing what is best. Did he also do what was best for your husband, <gasps> your majesty? Oh, snap, son, you didn't! Your name's on, on her list, mate. Please don't crash, game. Whew! Security camera on that column. Here we are. Well, there's a plant there. Matching hats, it's awesome! Hey, it's a doge! Hello, doge! Hey! Bonjour! What's going on? Somebody's coming! Oh, don't you do that to me! Dark spot! Destroy the fiend! Let's get started. On your guard! All right. Frost him up. Too easy. And fry him out. No, no, no. You leave Morgan alone. Only one shall stand. I shall do it. Desperation is an ugly. Get him. Too easy. He wags his tail happily in pants. Hey, Doge. It didn't hurt. Wait a minute. This is a dog who I helped at Ostagar. I think he was out there looking for you. He's chosen you. Mabari are like that. They call it imprinting. Does this mean we're going to have this mangy beast following us about now? Wonderful. He's not mangy. Well, he can come, but he better make himself useful. And yet we still have Alistair along. You know what this means. We need a name. Well, I shall name it after my last boyfriend. Dorn! Nice. Alright, that's good. Let's save. And we'll call it a day. So I will see you Wednesday with more Dragon Age Origins. And hopefully less crashing. <laughs>